<sighs> Sometimes I like to play my version of Russian roulette at night. I go to bed. Before I go to bed, I stand there and I'm like, did I take one of these? And the question is, did I take one of these? And if I did, or rather if I can, see, I can't even think. Oh my gosh. So I can't remember if I took one. So should I pop another and risk taking two? Or should I just not take one and risk not taking one at all? These are the pills that help me sleep. So, it's just risking me not sleeping. Which is dangerous for people who have to be around me tomorrow. At Bible study. Because I will have not slept. And I, I can be real mean. No. Um, <laughs> so, I just filled my grape juice for the night. Because I have routines, you know. I drink grape juice at night. It's by my bed. It's in a sippy cup. You want to know why it's in a sippy cup? I'm going to tell you why. I used to drink my grape juice in just a regular glass by the bed at night. One night, a bug of some sort crawled into my glass. You know where it's going. I drank the bug. Oh, didn't, didn't realize. And then I'm like, oh, why is my grape juice chunky? Because I drank the bug. Um, so now I, I, every glass I drink out of at night, cause it's dark, has a lid and a straw. So there's no critters, well not critters, no bugs crawling in my juice. I know, right? So gross. So gross. Ugh. But, um, those were the, those were the days, those are the days this morning when I woke up, like it was perfect timing right before my alarm came up. I grabbed my phone and I was going to turn it on and check the time. And then I realized there was a head on my shoulder. There's a head on my shoulder and it's grinning at me. And, and I look at that and I look at the grinning face and B. Arthur's like, it's time to get up, mama. And sure enough, my alarm just started to go off just as I did that. And she looked at me and I looked at her and we both had this moment. Have you ever had those moments with your dogs? You look at each other and you know just what the other's thinking. Yeah, well, me and B were having a moment. I do this with all my dogs. I used to do this with Mortimer. Oh my gosh, with Mortimer. We, one day I was being stupid. And we were running back and forth around the house. And then I thought I'd hide under the blanket and she wouldn't see me. Well, she watched me go under the blanket. She was there the whole time. And then I peeked out and she looked at me like, you dummy. And then she was just like, you're stupid. <laughs> but you know, whatever. I miss that dog. I miss that dog a lot. She was my first wiener. My first weenie dog. Got her after college. She was flown in from Florida. It was awesome. She was a great dog. She was a great dog. She was my first dog that I had on my own. And she had seizures. That's awesome for someone to have to figure out with your first pet on your own. When you don't have an adult. You are the adult. But we figured out how to handle that. So... Yeah. All right. Well, oh my gosh, it's my favorite niece. She's watching my stupid video. Hi, favorite niece. I'll be contacting you soon for some Girl Scout cookies. I love you. All right. Well, we're going to get ready for bed because five o'clock in the morning comes awfully early. And I've got a fat dog that's wanting to eat her biscuit. Oh. That stupid ramp in my backyard. It's, I mean, it's a helpful ramp because the, they couldn't do the stairs at all. But sometimes they can't do the ramp either because their high end doesn't work. But yeah, yeah, we're all going to get biscuits now. So 
you all have an excellent night. And um, I will see you all tomorrow. Goodbye.